Take me out for some hot dogs. All right. You know, I'm in Pennsylvania here. It's time to go raw dogging in PA. We're raw dogging Pennsylvania. That's right. We're at this place just outside of Easton in Palmer, Pennsylvania. This place is called Richard's Drive-In and the locals like to call it Greasy Dicks. Yes, that's right. You heard me right. The locals call this place Greasy Dicks. And they've been serving uh, hot dogs and hamburgers and anything you want, roadside food, in this classic 1950s style looking pink building since 1966. They've been around for almost 60 years. And we're here, we're gonna give these hot dogs a try as we continue raw dogging on the road in America. Let's see just how good these dogs are. Yes, I'll get one hot dog plain, nothing on it. Okay. I'll get one hot dog with chili and cheese. I'll get uh, a, uh, an order of fries and a large diet coke with a wife. That'll be it. All right, here we are. Richard's drive-in, also known as Greasy Dicks. And this is the hot dog. This is the uh, the raw dog. And. Mm -hmm. They, uh, it looks like, I don't know, I don't think they split naturally. It kind of looks like it has a good crunch. One to door ratio looks decent enough. But now here comes the real test. How does this hot dog taste? This hot dog is a single. It could come close to a double, but it's something that it, it just misses a double by this much. It's not a bad dog per se, it's just an average dog. And there really is nothing special about it. Now I'm also gonna try the chili and cheese. And there's a catch only place. I see the chili, but I don't see much cheese here. Of course, the hot dog is split and they cook the inside out. This dog misses the mark. The chili tastes like a canned chili. They split the dog. There's nothing special about how the dog is cooked. There's not much snap. It's an average dog. You think a place that's nicknamed Greasy Dicks would have much better hot dogs. But sadly they don't. And these fries. No snap, no crunch. Underdone, 5.1. You know, you're not always gonna find the best dogs when you go raw dogging. 
uh, especially on the road. So, if you know of a good place, leave a comment down below. And, and when you leave a comment down below, you can click on the link and you can buy my shirt. Yes, that's right. You can go to the Barstool store, buy a raw dog shirt. You can be virtually raw dogging with me. You know, sad to say, I was not impressed by uh, this place. Uh, I've been to better places, but you can click like and subscribe and you'll know where I'm going next. As you continue raw dogging on the road and uh, Places like Greasy Dicks or Richard Driving. You know, there are many places out there. Sometimes they're good, sometimes they're not. But I enjoy going there anyway. So next time, keep raw dogging. Take me out for some hot dogs. Get me one that's only plain. No mustard or horror ketchup. I'll know what the dog is really about in its hope. That this is a good one, maybe a home run or a double. But if it sucks, it will be a strikeout and not worthy of my taste buds. <laughs> on the road again. Gee, I can't wait to get on the road again. Going to all doggy places that I've never been. And I can't wait to get on the road again. You don't have to wait for me to get on the road again. You can order this nice, New shirt, raw dogging on the road, and when I'm on the road again, you better believe I'll be carrying this shirt with me. You can get it right now at the Barstool store.